No! Don't do it! Yay! <laughs> I did it! <laughs> that's like 20 tokens. It's like, yeah, that's so many. Yeah. Yeah, you have like 20 poison counters. I did it. I did the thing. <laughs> My fair citizens of Sodium City, this week's for our Jank vs. Jank, we are sitting down with Delmo. If you don't know who Delmo is, he is an amazing Italian streamer. Now, he does speak a lot of English, so if you end up showing up and talking with him, he'll definitely respond in English, if you speak English. But he is an amazing player, super entertaining guy, a great singer, by the way. So if you're lucky, he'll sing for you as well. But I really hope you enjoy it. All of his social media links will be in the comment section below, and you'll probably see cards show up in the video somewhere. So stay salty and enjoy the games. Let's go. All right. Are you ready or are you not know. ready? I don't, I don't know. I don't know if I'm ready. I feel like it's probably going to be bad, but who knows? It's probably going to be bad. Uh... Oh, or it's know gonna should... be me. Okay. No, it's gonna be me, actually. <laughs> All right. It's definitely gonna be me. Yours better be janky. Wait, there's jank in standard? Since when? There's... Oh, this is so jank. You have no idea. All right. It better have... You are not... <laughs> like, better this have is so bad. Engine. It's so bad, it's good. I'm interested. I'm just gonna say I hope you have creatures because I have like 38 board wipes in my hand. Oh. Sorry. Don't. <laughs> it's not needed. I, I said it before you put it down, okay? <laughs> it's good, but it's not needed. Alright. Like, yeah, because that would have been... I have many ways to do this. You have many ways to win? No, it's right. one, but I have many ways to reach the point that I can win. Mm. It's it's hard to explain, but you'll see. No. All right, I'm holding up counter spell mana, so watch out. Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you counter this, <laughs> okay, why? I mean, I'm insulted that you would think I would ever run counter spells. First of all. But I'm also confused. Imagine counter spelling jank decks. Yeah, no, that's just disrespectful. Are you gonna drop like a thousand gods on my face? Why would I do that? Because you have the the funny tree. Uh oh, no, I'm not doing that. Ah, okay, okay. So everything now has cascade, right? Yes, basically. I think. I don't exactly know how Cascade works, but I th I think I've heard people talk about that as yeah, Cascade. Yeah, that's basically Cascade. Uh, I don't know if I have to concede right now or show you my win condition. <laughs> <laughs> don't concede. Yeah, there's no conceding. This is a jank thing. Come on. Just let me do it. Oh, interesting. Ooh, what are you copying? No, no, I have to beat you with uh, with an 8-8. Oh, yeah, you might just kill me. Oh, nice. Oh, so the, the, the tree just for mm -hmm. fixing. Oh, nice. Yeah, oh. yeah, it's just mana fixing. Okay. Because it is a very, very, very... Uh, I mean, anything four colors is going to be ridiculous. Okay, do I have to show you my second win condition? I don't know. You can show me whatever you want, but uh, yeah, see, that's what I thought. I, I assumed you were copying Flynn the Gangbanger, because why wouldn't you, right? Oh, easy. Win. Surprise, what, what, what? No, come on. <laughs> Instant I don't victory. even, like, I don't even have the time to to realize what's, what's, go what's, <laughs> what's happening, I mean. Exactly. Yeah. English. That's Come the on. best part. That's the best part about it. English is not easy for me in the morning. English isn't easy for anybody anytime. 
Oh, okay. It's fine. So just again, rematch. I want to... Yep. We'll do like two real games and then and then we'll jank off as hard as we can. <laughs> okay. So depending yours looks like it could be super janky, so I'll definitely let you jank off pretty hard. Alright, I have a lot of red in my hand and no red sources. I feel like I shouldn't have kept this hand. Game session. Wait, what do you I need, need snow creature. permanence for? Graven lore. Graven lore? I don't you even know what that does. The, the things. I need to find the things. Wait, is that what you was that the eight eight that you played? The pugilist? Huh. <gasps> no. Nah. So basically, if I manage to have four creatures in play with the with the the other side of the pugilist, I just win. Yeah, yeah, exactly. But yeah. I never do. If you have five creatures can, out and I swing, can. get through with well, one. When I was trying this deck for today, all the games I played, I never won with the combo. Oh, really? <laughs> I always won like with actual beating. Oh. That's sad. I mean, that's good though, right? It's not. Is it not? If I like, miss, you, you if are I not miss supposed another to land like drop, this. I'm super dead. All right, not the land I wanted. <laughs> this is definitely not the land I wanted. Oh, you're scrying with Graven Lord. That's what yeah, that it's one like is. the best. Like this is interesting. Uh, it's it's this enough? I think it's enough. No, don't do it. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I did it. <laughs> that's like twenty tokens. It's like, yeah, that's so many. Yeah, yeah, you have like twenty poison counters. I did it! I did the thing! <laughs> <laughs> that was That's your first time getting that through? I honestly, I tried to make that deck in Historic and uh, it didn't work out too well. <laughs> <laughs> I, I tried like, so many the, times. For like, the math, for the, for the numbers, uh, you, I, you need... Yeah, you need three. You need three creatures. Because everything stacks. No, so yeah, you need three because two it's eight. Two mm -hmm. it's eight poison counters. Yeah, you need three yeah. creatures. Yeah, I was doing five and trying to get one through. So I would make <clears throat> tokens. Oh, okay. I yeah, would make tokens yeah. and get <clears throat> one through. Rematch, go. Again? Yeah, I'm waiting on you, man. Yeah. Maybe I can improvise another junk deck. <laughs> but this is so cool. This is so, I have so many ways to win. Like I won a game with Philia, and with, with, Philia. with what? Philia. With the 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 big elemental that like the um, the Avengers of Zendikar wannabe. Ah, uh, you have to show me that one. I have no idea. Yeah. Beat me yes, with it. Like the one that create plants and then every plant get plus four plus four when you go landfall. I have no idea what that card is. I'll show you. That sounds horrifying. Could you not? <laughs> I'll show you! <laughs> there we go. That's okay. much better. So what do I want? You want nothing. I actually want some want things in life. The I dude in that artwork looks hideous, by the way. Which one? In cram session? I dissociate from that. It's, it's a bit ridiculous. This is Filiat. You're gonna see it in the footage. <laughs> in... Was it three mana? Oh. No, it's, no, you're gonna see in the footage from my hand. I don't, I, I, don't, okay. I don't even know if I'm gonna... 
play this. But what? You don't know if you're gonna play it? Why not? Why won't you? Why won't you show? I don't know. Maybe you have counter spells in your jank deck. We don't do that. Uh huh. Maybe you're gonna. Okay, you won, right? No, I don't. I don't have it. No. G. But I want to know what this card is. <laughs> so you're gonna just pass in your in your turn? I might. Okay. So are you ready for the slowest oh. win condition ever? And this was supposed to be one of the best cards in standard when Zandy can drop out? Yeah. Sure. This. Oh, that card. Yep. That card's funny. All right. Well, good luck. Dang it. It's not enough. <laughs> I know, I didn't get a second one. I was hoping for another one. <laughs> well, good luck. I had, like, okay. <laughs> yeah, I know. I said good luck. <laughs> you had good luck. All right. Okay, so. No, it's, no, this is not enough. But I can do a lot of funny things. Oh my gosh. No! Goodbye, wolf. I love when people play that card, though. It's a sweet you card. ain't solving problems today, wolf. Okay. Wait. Is that death? That's a lot of... That is death, isn't it? Oh, no, 17. No, it's not. All right, come on. Wait, are those just what? forever counters? Like, this, this is oh. actually too slow for standard, but this card is so cool. How is it too slow for standard? Yeah, I don't know. I'm fast as fuck, boy. I mean, six mana pass is not that. Yeah, but six mana pass with a ton of damage on the board. So basically, now, if you don't have another way, like, I, I want to win in the cool way. Mm hmm. So I can slam you for 20 damage <laughs> or five. Or I like the or. Nice. Yeah, I was liking the or more too. <laughs> the or is definitely the move. Yeah. Definitely the move. Exact I mean I mean is this deck, I think it's standard viable for best of one. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, because there's not very many board wipes, right? Yeah, like... Because that, that survives... If you find one red, even a 1-3, it's good enough on turn 2. That's true. Yeah, it is really good. Alright, one more. Yeah, sure. We got one more. Then And then we'll just go over the decks real quick. Yep. Yeah, someone made me change my avatar in stream today. To Zahili? Yeah. Yeah, she cool. Yeah, but we gotta do the silver quest. Oh yeah, that's right. They did the news announcement for like the different colleges oh, and the points and stuff. Like I read the the college thing. Yeah. I understand nothing. Nothing. I, like, I didn't what, read what, it. What are we supposed to do? Um, the only thing I remember from the initial one is that you're supposed to use the Silver Quill avatar, the pet, and the sleeves. Yeah, but during what? <laughs> like... Yeah, exactly. An, an I thought it was just all the time, but it seemed like the new one made it yeah. sound like it was an event, but I didn't, event, I didn't yeah. read it yet. Why do you always have cram session on turn two? It's like a turn have, one what? shock in Thoughtseize. It's, that's, it's that's my companion it cram session. Oh. Makes sense. Makes sense. I, think I, I see that now. It's under your name. Yeah. Cram session. Yeah. Yeah. It's Delmo cram session. You know what a good companion would be? What? 
have hazard bombardment. Uh, no, no, a one mana, red, red creature, two one, haste. Done, with with the old companion rule. <laughs> you like commander? I'm sure there's a commander like that. Is that? Probably. There's got to be. There's got to be some random legendary creature that's like that. Mm. Or just wizards reprint goblin guide, please. Oh my gosh. Why? Why? No goblin guide. Why would you want goblin guide? What kind of person are you? I'm the goblin guide kind of person. But why? I, I am the triple fervent champion turn one and two kind of kind of person. Ew. When I'm not playing jank, of course. <laughs> when do you ever so, play jank? Let's be real. Every time I go on your stream, you're playing kind jank. Of jank. No, no, my kind of jank. It's like decks that are not supposed to work, and then suddenly they work. Sadly, they work. Yeah, like I don't know. I make the bo I, a Boros list with uh -huh. Revel in Silence that still turns and just win. Yeah, and... that's a great card. That's yeah, like... but like this is competitive jank, like you know, playing yeah. cards that you're not supposed to play. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I got a great Boros Fog deck that uses that and Tefri's protection. It's hilarious. <laughs> I think Proctor is a very underrated card. I think that needs Strict to be Proctor? In there. Yeah, Strict Proctor. There's a problem with Strict Proctor. What? That like mm, doesn't work together with all the good white cards. Huh, interesting. Are you not supposed to do like broken stuff with, with Genesis Ultimatum? I'm trying to do something. <laughs> I don't know what I'm You're doing. Just yet. Like, like you are pay you are playing a super overcosted cultivate. You no, know, I, I hey, I'm getting them. <laughs> I'm getting it on the battlefield at least. Okay. <laughs> Maybe I'll get something this turn. You ready? Yeah, like this turn. Yeah, sure. I could be dead this turn, right? You could have the combo right now. Yeah, this turn, right, right. Nah. <laughs> I should just. This is away. a lot of poison counters. This is a lot of poison counters. It's yeah. actually. Is that gonna know. break it? <laughs> it's, it's 30 triggers. It's 60 nice. poison counters. 60 poison? Easy. Yeah, I had this anger. Deck. I had so many board wipes, I was just gonna let it happen. <laughs> I was really, I was just stubborn. I got the Genesis ultimatum and then lands and I was like, mm. and I did the other I'm one and I was scared. like, mm. I got to keep finding another one. I'm scared of uh, how well this deck performed. <laughs> All right. Do you want to paste your deck list into discord? Yeah, sure. I'm also getting some echo from your microphone. I can hear myself through your microphone. It's possible. All of a sudden. I don't know. Just randomly started happening. It's good now. Okay. So now, I, because I, now I muted again. Like when I realized that I was mute on OBS, I unmuted me. <laughs> and now I muted it again it's, and it's fine. Uh, okay. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> no, like uh, I was. I was shivering, like, oh my god, we have to do this again? No. <laughs> oh, and luckily. pretend it's fine? Okay. Yeah, I, it, same thing happened with Ziggy Sawdust. We recorded for, like, an hour. And he's like, how mad would you be if I didn't record any of this? And I was like... <laughs> ah. <laughs> I was so disappointed. Yeah, Oh, it so happened to me with uh, with a podcast, um, <laughs> with an episode of my podcast. Oh my gosh! Wait, you have a podcast? Yeah, yeah. On on uh, Wednesday evening. What is it? Shout it out. Uh, but but it's like not on Spotify. It's just on my channel. Like your YouTube? No, no. Uh, it's live. Oh, on your Twitch? I just do I just do it on Twitch, yeah. Yeah. Shout it out. This it's, will uh, be Tribale going Besti. on YouTube. So It's Tribale Bestia podcast on Wednesday. It's in Italian, but still. 
it's full of funny and good looking people definitely true good looking do you sing on it no i don't but i sing all the time during the stream so also i even true. like now i'm uh, i started this meme that i always start with the song the the stream like an opening do you actually though i yeah. never i never get there at the beginning then yeah because like i think my beginning is like your ram phase <laughs> right yeah probably it's two a it, like it's two p.m. in my time zone. It's GMT plus one. Oh yeah, that's yeah, that's super early. That's like five a.m. Yeah. four or five a.m. Yeah. for me. <laughs> I wake up. I wake up at like six fifty-five because I have to work at seven. <laughs> so maybe you can sometime catch my stream uh, before going to work, right? Like early in the morning during the breakfast. I don't eat breakfast, but yeah, like, well, I work at home right now. You don't, or like, where, where are you from? I, li I live in Arizona, in the United States. Okay, you... But I work at home, you, so I just, I get up and then I, I walk into the other room. I need okay. a proper diet. Yeah, you never skip breakfast. Always you skip breakfast. You just don't. No, well, you have to, you, you... No, it's, I'm good. good. Yeah, but like, not, not the, 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 the breakfast, like uh, a thousand strips of bacon and stuff like that like that's not breakfast well i yeah i i was big into health for a while and then yeah i had a bunch of issues but <laughs> yeah. yes no. everyone should everyone in the world should have an italian friend that teach him how to eat properly <laughs> yeah well it's different for everybody uh keto, yeah. keto works best for me and so i'm on the ketogenic yeah. diet but i also do intermittent okay. fasting intermittent fasting also worked best for me so okay. I just do that and it's really easy for me. I just, I have dinner and just a protein shake. So I have a four hour eating window and that's it. I eat at, okay. I, I have my shake at 12 and then I eat at 4 PM. Oh, that's, that's interesting. That's actually interesting. Yeah. It works really well for me. It, I spend less time in the kitchen cooking and cleaning and yeah. good stuff though yeah i just get to make korean barbecue and shit all the time uh it's delicious love. dude korean barbecue is where it's at all right let's take I a look barbecue. let's look yeah. at your deck by the way <clears throat> okay now your deck yeah so it's standard it is that's fucking weird <laughs> is it actually 100 percent standard it's actually 100 percent standard yeah like I try to make this historic for the today, but it's that's there's no meaning. Yeah, that. yeah, you don't need to. Yeah. Like the point of the deck is just super simple. You need to have uh, at least three creatures out. Then you go find the Fang Bearer and uh, Echoing Equation. Okay, I was Jeez. I never remember the name of the thing. I just yeah. call it the other side of the pugilist. <laughs> so you do the other side of the pugilist on Finn. I never remember a pugilist. I never remember that yeah. name. I will never remember it. <laughs> Echoing equation is how I know it because the other one is just a creature. Who cares about creatures? Yeah. <laughs> it just You win the game with poison counters. But sometimes, yeah. like most of the times, you just win the game by swarming or filiating. Yeah, because this <laughs> thing is hilarious. Yeah. And then you have the sideboard of uh, Preach, basically. lessons, because now we can, yeah, with the beautiful true. interface. Beautiful, beautiful. See, yeah, I, beautiful. I don't think this is that bad. Or are you talking about when you search the sideboard? I've literally never cast a single learn spell before. No, no, I'm, I'm talking about the... The deck building thing? Yeah, the the the, the old one off in the yeah, that's weird. I split. Yeah, I mean, it's okay. weird that you have three of them, but it's all set mm. to one of. Mm. That's bizarre to me. It makes me think that they're all from different sets, but they're not. Yeah, the full passage problem. Yeah, that's what <laughs> I do. Well, I do it for like every basic land, so it's it's normal for me. Anyway, like the, the the stars of this of this deck is feel is Fila. 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 Okay, it's Fila. 
because uh, like I don't know, did this win so many games that I actually thinking about making a, an actual team or ramp deck with this? Yeah, but maybe yeah, just I, throw in maybe, waking maybe. the trolls and you're good. Oh, don't. <laughs> yeah, you get an extra land Mana for terrain. it. That, that means you get another plant because you get a land from it. All right. See, it's one extra plant. That's one extra buff. Exactly. Also yep. that. And then you get trolls after that, which is also hilarious. You're trolling with trolls. Exactly. That's that's Pugil is, how it's you a win. troll actually. Is it really? Yeah, it's a troll druid. It is. That's funny. See, you already have I trolls. Mean, Might troll as well go all in. It is a troll deck for sure. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, so why only three binding old gods instead of like three scoot swarms? I feel like you would need more instant removal not instant removal but actual targeted removal mm, nah, i don't think it's needed just make it like, a 61 card swarm, special like, like you need to you need to 100 percent swarm in, in every single game you you don't you you play your own game like this is mostly for the second chapter mm. <laughs> and still removing stuff but Everything getting death touch is also pretty nice, though. Yeah. Your scute swarm, all your little tokens getting death touch. Yeah, you, you can out, win you with, uh, one, with this. Yeah, yeah, you throw out one gangbanger. You're good to go. That's pretty nice, too. Yeah. And the crumb session, it's good. Yeah. If you have only crumb sessions on two, <laughs> every time, every game, it's fun. Because in the sideboard you can go, like, you mostly go for pest summoning if you need creatures or just science for another land. That's true, you get two pests. Yeah. And then they're just blockers. And then you gain life once they die. Or you win. Or that, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. That works too. <laughs> like, I never played mascot exhibition, but like, well, why not? Yeah, it's, just put it's it there, there just in case. I yeah. would have another one, the introduction to Annihilation. Maybe I can go like two pest summonings, actually. That's probably better, since you yeah. use it a lot and you get it most of the time. Yeah, but still, will janky, right? So I, I need to play the the overcosted janky limited lesson, right? True. That does make sense. Yeah. When you put it that way, it makes sense. <laughs> I just like this deck actually win games in best of one standard yeah yours are you gonna take it to a tournament what are you doing with no that? it's it's a best of one list like you you can play this on only best, best of, of one yeah you can't remove cards from this <laughs> you can't <laughs> <laughs> you did that much testing no, I just look like, like okay. Uh, what do you remove from this? To side I in. I don't, I don't play best of three. Don't look at me. Yeah, it's like I owe you never. I also <laughs> don't play standard, so I have no idea. Yeah, maybe I, maybe I can just throw this in a in a tournament with the, the best of one list and never sideboard. Maybe. Yeah, exactly. You just throw like, in some know, extra. You just throw in some extra lessons, right? Yeah. You know, Winota, the, there was a Winota list that made like top eight in a tournament that was uh, like this with seven lessons and done. Really? With no and there, was, yeah. there was no sideboard? <laughs> yeah, it, it makes sense because Winota, it's like this like you have one strategy. Yeah, that's you true. You have to afford to remove cards in, in a Winota deck. So you just like play, you, you play like the, the old Team World Adventures. Yeah. You don't sideboard. That's funny. Because you don't need it. That's so stupid. Yeah. But yeah, my deck is just a play on Approach of the Second Sun. Because yeah, you, you cast it from your hand, and then when you have Sunbird's Invocation out, it's just sitting there like, once you cast Spell from your hand, it's going to look at the top X cards from your library, and since Approach yeah. is 7 mana, you look at the top 7 cards. And if there is an Approach in the top 7 cards, you're actually casting it from your library. So you cast it from your library with Summer's Invocation, and then Approach says, if this spell was cast from your hand and cast any other time in the game, then you win. You won. You exactly. Win. Yeah. So, 
And it doesn't work with copying or anything, it only works with casting. So that's why you have to cast it somehow, and that's why casting it with Sunbird's Invocation out of the deck is the best way to do it. Uh, and then it's just an instant win. You end up just winning by approaching one time. It's funny. Uh, I have the yeah, Genesis it's... Ultimatum in there just kind of for funsies. It's another thing you can get with approach. So if you cast approach, you also get Genesis Ultimatum. You could most likely, and you probably should, take it out and add in Star of Extinction. <laughs> that that probably makes more sense. Because it's good removal, it kills Planeswalkers. Right now the only Planeswalker sure. removal we have is Battle of Frost and Fire. Which is nice, but... I don't know. Genesis Ultimatum right now doesn't do anything outside of get a Sunbirds, possibly. And then yeah, get, like, and then get like lands. It, it draws a lot of cards, though, which is nice. Yeah, sure. Who doesn't like card draw? Seven mana, draw five. <laughs> <laughs> I like that's That's good. Like, yeah, yeah, it's not bad. Seven mana, draw five, it's good. Yeah, because once, well, once you get the approach in your hand, it's really nice, because then you just kind of win at that point. Yeah, it's better than Into the Story. Seven yeah. mana, draw five. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. But that's pretty much it. It's just a weird four-color... Sunbird's approach deck. That's cool. Yeah. It's fun. I had a really good one back in the day. I just haven't updated that specific list yet. I was trying out some other methods and it was failing pretty hard today. So <laughs> I tried this one. I was like, eh, it's a little better. Throwing yeah, at least you are not playing the super boring Azorius control with one uh, approach. Oh, no, that's lame. That is super lame. Uh, although yeah. the last one I did today... There's a mono white prison one that's surprisingly good using inspiring statuary for the ramp. Wait a second. Which I don't know if you know that. It's non artifact spells you cast have improvise. So you just run cards like Glass Casket and Treasure Map, Cosmos Elixir. Things that give you. Oh, utility. yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Things, things that give you utility, but just tap for colorless as well. So you can cast Approach of the Second Sun with like three artifacts and then four lands out. It's just ridiculous. It's really oh. funny though. It wins? Yeah, yeah, it's won, it's won quite a bit. I think it's seven and three after the changes, something like that. So it's doing all right. It was terrible at first and I'd make a bunch of changes. <laughs> I had to change like 15 cards. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, oh, this needs an overhaul. <laughs> it's a completely different deck. Yeah, yeah, it's it's pretty much different. It uses the same the same concept of using statuary and approach to the second sun. Uh it still uses Tefri's protection and our revelation, but that's yeah, it's a completely different deck. It's weird. But yeah, it's, yeah it that's pretty cool. much it though. Uh, thank you so much for doing this. It was really fun. Thank you. Doing a lot. I had fun. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead and shout yourself out. Your channel, both of them, YouTube, Twitch. Okay. So I'm I'm Delmo. Uh, my channel is Il Delmo, twitch.tv slash Il Delmo, and uh, I I stream in Italian, but like I have some people, some non-Italian people following me because the they are actually learning Italian with me. <laughs> And they say it's understandable, so it's better. And uh, I play mostly aggro, but I tend to try stuff. I sing a lot. <laughs> and I have a YouTube channel, which is uh, mostly or basically 100% highlights from the from the Twitch channel. So, mm -hmm. And you can follow me on socials with uh, Delmo222. Delmo222? Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, and all the links will be in the description below as well. But definitely show him some love. Uh, Dumbo's a super cool guy. Good friend of the stream and the channel. So, yeah, do that. Thank you all so much for watching. If you made it to this point, it means you either really enjoyed the video or you fell asleep and I'm waking you up now. <laughs> either way, thank you for all the support. I really do appreciate it. If you want to see more videos like this, hit that subscribe button. Hit the bell notification. Come out with videos seven days a week.